One of the ways to think about this in a more systematic way is to borrow from a book called Creativity Inc. about Pixar. Creativity Inc. is written by one of the founders of Pixar named Ed Catmull. And he talks about how Pixar, to produce their movies over and over again, these really great movies, embraces this idea of shitty first draft. So this is a little bit from his book. You want to read it, Miss Hoffman? Early on, all of our movies suck. That's a blunt assessment, I know, but I choose that phrasing because saying it in a softer way fails to convey how bad the first versions really are. So he's being very candid about this, but imagine sort of like movies like Toy Story or Finding Nemo or WALL-E or Up. What he's saying is in the beginning, those movies suck. He's very, very committed to this idea of from the beginning, things are bad. What makes our company really good is that we figured out a process of how to improve. So he explains a little bit more about that process. Read it for us. Creativity has to start somewhere, and we are true believers in the power of bracing candid feedback and the iterative process, reworking, reworking, and reworking again until a flawed story finds its through line or a hollow character finds its soul. But I just want to emphasize reworking, reworking, and reworking again. How many times they go through drafts of these movies and cuts of these movies. The other really important part of this is the idea of bracing candid feedback. And that brings us to our next concept, which is the idea of an extra ear. 